And from here, I'm gonna pour it into this jar for storage. Nice and smooth that is. It's smelling of all that cinnamon, the vanilla, so yummy looking. This is Sharla Rose and welcome back to my channel. Hope you guys are having a beautiful day so far. And most of all, guys, please, please, please keep safe, okay? So in this video, guys, I'm going to be making my white chocolate sauce. This sauce you could use to make your hot chocolate, your coffee, anything that requires some white chocolate sauce. Guys, this is the sauce for you. So if you want to see me do this white sauce, guys, please keep watching this video. It's going to be bomb. It's going to be yummy. It's going to be everything delicious. Okay? So, guys, if you're new here, welcome, welcome, welcome. And if you're an oldie but goodie, thank you guys for sticking around. Please, guys, subscribe to my channel. I would really appreciate it. And I do see that I've been getting a lot of love over here lately. Thank you, guys. Thank you. Thank you. So to kick this video off, guys, you're going to need some ingredients and I have a whole lot of stuff here. So you want to start with some mixed essence, some vanilla essence, half and half, some light corn syrup. You could use sugar if you want. Um, I have some rose water, some white chocolate chips, and I also have some heavy whipping cream. But you could omit some of this ingredients if you want to, but this is just the way I make mine, okay? And um, down the line, guys, you'll see me add another ingredient. So if you want to see what that is, definitely watch this video until the end. Okay, guys, so please go subscribe, like the video, YouTube like, like it when you love up the videos and stuff like that it just promotes it for me and help me to go for you guys okay so please hit that subscribe button the like and comment to let me know what you think about this video okay so let's get started so i have a saucepan here with about i want to say about one cup of water and I'm going to add a cinnamon stick to this and I'm going to let that boil until the color of my water have changed to like, you know, a little darker because of the cinnamon stick. So I'm going to leave that and let it boil on high and the water has reduced to like half of the amount and I'll be right back. So already you could see that the water have changed color and that's from boiling the cinnamon stick so i think it has gotten to where i want it to be so i'm just gonna start adding my other ingredients my water have reduced that's about as much as i need to flavor my sauce I'm gonna just use up this, the rest of this that I have. It's the heavy whipping cream. So that's one cup. Ooh, it looks so good. Okay guys, so that's what it's looking like so far. I'm still gonna add some half an hour. rose water but I'm gonna put in my spices first so this is rose water vanilla essence and mix essence Then I'm gonna add some hot, and I'm using this instead of the sugar only because this has a thicker consistency. I'm 
then I'm gonna have this is a 11 ounce pack so I'm gonna see how much I'm gonna get three cups of this oh my god that's a lot so I'm just gonna put the whole bag not even gonna measure Now it's not all the way sweet. I could taste the vanilla and the cinnamon and all that stuff that was in there. I'm also gonna add a little bit of salt. Like half. What the salt does, it helps to balance all that sweets. So I'm gonna leave this on low to medium heat and let it reduce to a thicker consistency. Mm, it's yummy right now. Perfect. So I'm gonna check this back in like, I wanna say five minutes on medium low and then come back to you guys. So this is what the sauce is looking like right now. It's still not all the way thick as I want it to be. I'm just gonna leave it and let it simmer down some more because that's still quite a large amount for what I need it for so I'm just gonna leave it there so guys my white sauce wasn't getting as thick as I wanted it to be so I added some cornstarch so I just did a sample in this cup here because I didn't want to do the whole pot and then it didn't turn out okay so I'm so this is the consistency that it is right now, kind of looking like condensed milk. So I'm going to pour this in the rest of the sauce. This is what the sauce is looking like and it's been on for a while and it's still not getting as thick as I want it to be. So I'm going to have the cornstarch mix mixture and see how it turns out. So this is the cornstarch portion of the thing. Wish me luck guys. Hope it turns out okay. And it's thickening up right off the bat guys. Right off the bat. Right off the bat it's thick. So after adding the cornstarch, you can see that it has thickened tremendously. So what I'm going to do with those little chunks that are in there, which is from the cornstarch, I'm going to strain this and that's it. And it's nice and flavorful. So let's do this guys and to store this in your refrigerator you could put it in a airtight bottle and then keep this to make your white or chocolate whenever you feel like it and there's tons of more recipes that you could use this white sauce to make okay i'm just gonna be making two okay So this is my white chocolate sauce and I'm gonna taste this to make sure there's no trace of that pine starch even though I didn't put too much. You're not tasting anything at all. All it did was help to thicken it. So now I'm gonna strain it.
get rid of those little chunks from the cornstarch and as you can see guys this is looking like condensed milk already right so um i got rid of all the chunks my pot is free of chunks so i'm just gonna return this back to the pot I'm not even sure why I did this part. Guys, you could just transfer from the cup straight to your glass jar and that's it. And from here, I'm gonna pour it into this jar for storage. and smooth that is it's smelling of all that cinnamon the vanilla so yummy looking so I got a full jar from that so I'm gonna have that cool right there So this is my homemade white sauce that I used to make my white hot chocolate and stuff like that. And you could use this for a numerous amount of stuff. You could even use this for your regular hot chocolate and things like that. So until the next video guys, please like, share, comment, subscribe to my channel, hit that notification bell, and you'll be notified of other single time. I put a new video up. So until the next video, see you later.